This is an assumptions question. The conclusion is that construction firms will reduce their consumption and so taxes will protect the state's woodlands. The missing link is between there being taxes on construction firms and the conclusion that the firms will reduce their wood consumption and so the taxes will protect the state's woodlands. Our broad expectation from the correct answer choice is that it should strengthen this conclusion through a valid assumption which fills the missing link and must be necessarily true for the conclusion to hold. Answer choice A. This answer choice says that construction firms will reduce the amount of wood they consume by reducing the number of projects. So basically this answer choice talks about a method of reducing wood consumption. However, the method of reduction is immaterial so long as there is a reduction in the amount of wood consumed. In other words, this answer choice does not have to be true for the conclusion to hold. It is possible that the firms will reduce their consumption and the taxes will protect the state's woodlands even if the firms do not reduce the number of projects they take on. So this answer choice cannot be a valid assumption. So let's eliminate this answer choice. Answer choice B. This answer choice says that the taxes will not significantly affect the profits of the firms even if they do not reduce the amount of wood they consume. If this is so, it indicates that the firms do not have any incentive to reduce the amount of wood they consume. In such a case, it weakens the conclusion that there will be a reduction in the consumption of wood. So this answer choice does not strengthen the conclusion and cannot be an assumption. Let's eliminate this answer choice. Answer choice C. The argument is concerned with the taxes protecting the state's woodlands. Whereas this answer choice talks about woodlands outside the state. So this answer choice is out of scope. Also, this answer choice does not have to be true for the conclusion to hold. So this answer choice cannot be a valid assumption. So let's eliminate this answer choice. Answer choice D. This answer choice says that the state residents consider the beauty of woodlands as an important issue. However, this answer choice makes no suggestion regarding whether there will be a reduction in consumption and whether the taxes will protect the state's woodlands. So this answer choice is just additional information and does not strengthen the conclusion. Also, this answer choice does not have to be true for the conclusion to hold. So this answer choice cannot be a valid assumption. So let's eliminate this answer choice. Answer choice E. This answer choice states that the taxes will not induce the construction firms to illegally harvest wood from the woodlands. If this is so, it indicates that when the taxes are deployed, the firms will be forced to reduce their consumption and hence the taxes will protect the state's woodlands. So this answer choice strengthens the conclusion. Also, this answer choice has to be true for the conclusion to hold because negating this answer choice would mean that taxes will induce construction firms to illegally harvest wood from the woodlands. In such a case, it weakens the conclusion that there will be a reduction in the food consumption and the taxes will protect the state's woodlands. So this answer choice is a fair assumption. E is the correct answer choice.